So in this lecture, we are going to discuss the mechanism of diffusion or the molecular mechanism of diffusion. In the last lecture, we have discussed that the um, movement of ions or molecules from a region of high concentration to a region of low concentration without the need of um, energy is known as passive, um, passive transport or diffusion. So, uh, if they, there is a substance in high concentration in one region, outside the cell or inside the cell, and it is moving from this region towards a region where its concentration is low, it is like a downhill movement or from the region with high concentration to region of low concentration, this passive movement, this is known as uh, diffusion. So, um, how this movement basically occurs? What is the basic mechanism of diffusion? What are the basic mechanics or mechanisms involved in this process? So, let's for example, we have a container which contains some fluid or water. It is having, this container is having water and the water is basically made of small molecules all these molecules are basically in uh, a movement or in motion and they are moving randomly the more the speed of the, the movement of these molecule the more will be the heat of uh, this uh, fluid or the container or if we heat this container the motion of these molecules will increase what happens when these molecules move randomly for example this is one molecule this is basically one molecule we label it as A this is one molecule here it moves slowly and it comes into contact with another molecule we label it as B it moves and it comes in contact with another molecule molecule B or ion B whatever the energy of this molecule will get transferred to this molecule and the speed of this will this molecule will increase this molecule will come here and it will halt its movement and it will increase its movement and it will come in contact with another molecule the speed of this molecule will get converted to uh, this molecule C and the speed of the B will get halted or get stopped here in this way the molecules in this uh, or the ions in this uh, fluid they keep moving randomly gets uh, they kick each other they come in contact with each other they transfer the energy of each other uh, and then uh, they then their speed decreases and then with the the next molecule which come in contact with that molecule its speed definitely increase a point comes a point comes when one of the molecule lying outside a membrane gets hit by another molecule for example the B here get hit by A and it just crosses the membrane it just crosses the membrane and it may be a cell membrane it may be a, plas a lipid by layer of the plasma membrane or it may be a protein with a channel and this this process of random movement and transferring the energy of one molecule to the other and which results in the movement of some ions through the plasma membrane through the lipid bilayer or through some protein channel from the region of high concentration toward the region of low concentration is known as diffusion that's the simple mechanism which works behind uh, diffusion so what is diffusion or passive transport? 
transport it's uh, nothing but just it's the movement of molecule or ion within uh, a fluid which basically increases with heat and the, the movement of one ion they get uh, the movement of one ion creates some energy and when it hits another molecule it gets it transfers its energy to the next molecule then it transfers it to the next molecule and finally some molecule lying near the membrane has a chance to cross the membrane is the concentration of the molecule is high on this side so the movements and the chances of one molecule on this side to get transferred to the side with low concentrations are very high so they cross the membrane without any energy and that's how transport of ions or uh, molecules across the cell membrane occur hope you have understood the basic mechanism of passive transport or diffusion